The IG Grid Control ships with a host of valuable features, and the following slides give you an idea of what's possible with the grid. When editing data in the grid, sometimes users may want to make many changes at once and only commit the change set to the server. This is all possible using batch updates. There are many reasons why users may want to obscure columns from view from time to time in the grid. The column hiding feature works in both desktop and mobile contexts. The ability to move columns left or right makes user customization of the grid an easy task. Sometimes the data in a column needs to breathe. When enabled, the grid allows users to resize any column in the grid. Often grids can hold a lot of data, and column summaries can help provide aggregate calculations that are easy to see and are user customizable. Editing the grid is at the heart of its features. Whether editing inline or using an edit template, the grid supports the full spectrum of editing capabilities. The filtering feature allows users to quickly find the data they're looking for in large sets. Operators include starts and ends with, contains or doesn't, and equals or is not equal to the given value. Sometimes the best way to understand data is to see how it relates. The grouping feature makes it easy to see which rows have certain data points in common. Nested grouping is also supported. One of the favorites from Excel is the multi-column header, and the IG Grid has it too. A staple in grids is the ability to page data. The grid's paging feature is highly customizable. The selection behavior supports column, row, and cell selections. Selection sets can even be non-contiguous, as seen in this screenshot. For sorting, single and multiple column sorts are all available. And when it comes to changing the look and feel of the grid, you're in control of each aspect of the control. You can use CSS to change the look of specific elements, or you can completely restyle the grid using built-in or custom theme roller themes. The templating engine in the grid allows you to take full control of how data is rendered in each cell. Tooltips are a great way to provide extra information to users. On the desktop, tooltips can appear on hover or click, and in mobile contexts, tooltips are exposed with a tap to the cell. Built with performance in mind from the beginning, UI virtualization is available, which reuses HTML elements as new data is fed into the grid. Also available is continuous virtualization, which allows you to scroll the grid through massive amounts of data while staying responsive and keeping an accurate scroll bar position and size.